Excuse me, what are you doing here? Um, I'm shopping. We don't have clothes for people like you. What do you mean, people like me? You don't seem to understand. Bergstrom's is high fashion, not some sort of Costco. What's wrong with Costco? Nothing, if you like buying things in bulk. Bulk? What's that supposed to mean? It means... It means you're on your own. I'm sorry, Mrs. Sherman. I was dealing with a nuisance. That's all right. I called you here today because I have some exciting news. Exciting news? Am I finally getting that promotion? It's nothing like that. Today, we're announcing a new clothing line here at Bergstrom's. New clothing line? What do we need that for? I think a new clothing line is exciting. Well, it is exciting because we're finally going to target a large part of the market we've been missing. Good, because I talk to a lot of customers and they want different type of clothes. Don't listen to her. Customers need to be told what they want. They shouldn't be telling us. Well, the decision's already been made. And today, I am pleased to announce we are adding a major new fashion line. And the designer herself is going to be visiting our store. Really? Is it Kylie Jenner? Who's that? I hope it's Gloria Vanderbilt. Well, you're just going to have to wait to find out. And I'm also pleased that the president of Bergstrom's is coming with her. Bergstrom's is introducing a new clothing line. Sophia thinks it'll bring new customers, but Kathy only wants to wait on certain types of people. What do you think you're doing? I just gonna help a customer? I'm department head here. I decide who waits on who. But I thought I was supposed to help the customers. I don't know why they made you a salesperson. You don't know anything about making commission. I don't care about commissions. I'm a fashion consultant. Fashion consultant. Go wait on someone else. I'll take care of this lady. Fine, you're the department head. Sorry to keep you waiting. I'm Kathy, and I'll be your salesperson today. Hi, I'm Sophia. I'll be your fashion consultant today. Fashion consultant? I didn't know you had those here. Well, I like to think of myself as a fashion consultant. Some of the others here just think about themselves as sales ladies. I'm having trouble finding things that are my style. What do you think the fall trends are going to be? We haven't put out our fall styles yet. The sales ladies, they want to sell the old stuff first. Sophia, just what do you think you're doing? I'm waiting on the customer. I don't know why they made you a sales girl here. Stop giving away our secrets. I didn't know we had secrets. I was just trying to understand what she likes. Find out what they like? That's not how sales works. I don't know why they didn't just make you the dressing room attendant. Dressing room attendant? What is that? That's the person who has to pick up the dirty, stinky clothes the customers have tried on and then hang them up and make them look new again. What's wrong with that? Shouldn't everyone help out? What's wrong with that? There's no commission. You'll never be a success around here. Okay, Kathy. 
Kathy. Thank you. I just remembered. I have a return and it's in my car. Do you mind if I come right back? Yes, of course. I'll be happy to take care of your return. That is so refreshing. I'll be right back. So, what delights you? I think this is perfect for my style. Would that be cash or a credit card? I'm going to use my gift card. I'll be right back. You gotta be kidding me! Oh, there you are. I would like to get this too. You're not getting anything today. What? And why is that? Because this gift card you gave me is a scam! What? Well, my grandchildren gave me that for my birthday. <laughs> Well, obviously, your grandchildren cannot be trusted. What? Now, get out of my store. Oh, fine. Give me that. Oh. Hi, how are you today? I'm good. I'd like to make a return. Oh, that won't be a problem at all. Mrs. Sherman, you're watching at the office. Would you mind if I get someone to help you with that? Oh, uh, sure, I can wait. Sophia's customer is back with her return. But who will handle it for her? Oh, it's you again. What do you want? That other lady said I could make a return. Fine. You're lucky I'm easygoing. Let's see what you have. Okay, here you go. Where's your receipt? Um, I don't have it. But I got it as a gift from my boyfriend. There's no gift tag on this. Okay, that's fine. I'll just take a store credit. Do you expect me to believe that your boyfriend could wear this? Oh, I didn't know I needed your approval. I don't know what you're trying to take me for, but you didn't buy this. You know what? I don't have time for this. Give it back to me and I'll take it to another register. I don't think so. Wait right here. I'm getting security. Mrs. Sherman, I'm so glad to finally meet you. Likewise, Mr. Bergstrom. It is such an honor to have the president of the department store here. It's not every day that we introduce such an important new clothing line. It's very exciting. I know, we are so excited. Ladies! And that's the reason why we're putting a big emphasis on fashionable clothing for real women. And for this reason, I'm pleased to announce that we've signed a major distribution deal with the famous fashion designer, Lily Knight. Oh, Lily Knight. I love her clothes. So do I. And today, I have the extra special honor of introducing you to someone who's rarely ever been seen in public. Here she is, the one and only, Lily Knight herself. Wow! Nice to meet you. You? I also want to let you know that Lily here has been generous enough with her time to volunteer here at Bergstrom's as a secret shopper. Yes, I remember. Really? Yeah, I remember too. And as a result of this secret shopper program, we're going to make some changes around here. <laughs> 
Sophia, you're being promoted to department manager. Really? Nice work. I thought I was department manager. Oh, no, 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 Kathy. I've got big plans for you. <sighs> That's a relief. That's right, Kathy. You're getting what you deserve. You're our new dressing room attendant. What? Kathy was rude to a customer because of her size. Let's see how a pregnant shopper is treated. I finally get to meet Chad's parents. But I don't know what I'm gonna wear. How about you wear your prom dress? They've probably never seen that. Uh, hello? I don't think that's gonna fit. <laughs> oh yeah, what was I thinking? Do they know about the baby yet? Oh yeah, they're so excited about becoming grandparents. And they keep suggesting names. <laughs> names? I thought you didn't know if it was a boy or girl yet. <laughs> that's right. So maybe I should buy a dress that's pink and blue to cover both bases. Where should we go to get one? I don't know. I usually shop juniors. What kind of place does a mom go? Well, my mom shops at Bergstrom's. Ooh, I heard a lot of celebrities go there. <laughs> Come on, it's right at this end of the mall. Why are we going to Bergstrom's anyway? <sighs> because they have the hot new stuff. But that's where old ladies shop. <sighs> Bergstrom's isn't your mother's department store anymore. Really? Since when? <laughs> Haven't you seen it on social media lately? That's where all the hottest stars get their looks now. All right, let's check it out. Wow. So what do you think? I think we need more stores like this. <laughs> Good afternoon, girls. Welcome to Burstrom's. This place is so different than I remember. Well, even though Burstrom's been around for 98 years, we are really changing with the times. Yeah, we see your clothes all over social media. Where can I try some of this on? Well, pick out the styles you like and I'll hold them for you in the dressing room. Oh, wow. I think this would really impress them. Uh, looks expensive. <laughs> I hope Chad has a lot of money. Or hopefully a lot of room on his credit card. <gasps> Great. Now I gotta wait on kids? Can I help you two? Oh, uh, we're just looking. Have you two thought about looking in our clearance section downstairs? <laughs> well, my friend here needs a new dress. Yeah, I'm meeting my in-laws for the first time. Well, do you have a Bergstrom's account? Because this is our designer collection. Oh, designer. I love nice things. Wait a minute. That's the dress. Didn't Dua Lipa wear this to the oh, Grammys? Yeah, and I saw Kendall Jenner on a cover of a magazine <laughs> with this one. Please don't touch the merchandise unless you can pay for it. Uh, she can afford it. What's her deal anyway? <laughs> Olivia doesn't want to wait on younger customers because she knows that only older ones have money. Huh, this is nice and loose fitting. <laughs> yeah, yellow is really your color. Excuse me, young ladies. I have some important business to take care of. Ding dong, the Karen's gone. Yeah, I thought she'd never leave. Hello. Welcome to Bergstrom's. Oh, hi. I don't usually shop here. Oh, really? To what do we owe this pleasure today? To be honest, 
I felt your clothes were a little on the ordinary side. I usually shop at Goldman's. Oh, really? What is it about the Goldman's experience that pleases you so much? Well, I have my own personal shopper there who gets to know me and helps build my wardrobe. Oh, really? Well, we can do that and more. More? How can that be? Well, after all, Bergstrom's is where the celebrities shop. Celebrities? Count me in. Well, it's this way. Oh, crap. How do you feel about this teal color? I love that. I'm kind yeah. of in love with it. Yeah, yeah okay, fantastic. I'm definitely trying that on. I'm thinking about pairing these kind of edgy. Oh, you have to, that's right? a look. Yes. yes. I could definitely. I think it could work. I could see you making yes. that okay, work. Yes, okay, I have you to try that. Coles with clothes. <laughs> How do you feel about pearl necklines? Hmm. I've had, ooh. Embellishments, you know? I feel like it's classy, but it's not over the top. I think I might copy you a little bit, because this, <gasps> that would look really good on you. I love the I neckline. I think so, yeah. So girls, are you finding anything you like? Oh yes, quite a bit. <laughs> I think we're ready to try it on. <laughs> okay, shoppers, right this way. Other coats are on sale. I think this is my size. Huh. I'm sure they don't have one that fits me. Well, maybe you could ask that sales lady if they have any more of these. I think I'd rather go without than deal with her. Right this way. Ooh, and I wanna try this one on too. And I wanna try on all of these. Let's just start with what you selected and then we can try everything else on. I have two dressing rooms for you right over here. And if you have any questions, I'll be right here. Alicia's customers are showing an interest in a lot of clothing. Will they be able to afford them? And may I present to you our celebrities collection. Now that's more my style. In fact, do a Jenner wore this to an award show. Wow, and it looks like my size. And you might recognize this one, Kendall Lipa, wore it in a magazine cover. This is absolutely perfect for my daughter. Would you excuse me for a moment? Okay. Olivia, you have the lowest sales of any of the Bergstrom Associates at this location. I know I haven't been making sales, but the spring fashion line just came in. You haven't been providing the kind of service we expect. You need to treat all customers the same and not just the older ones. Listen, you know me. If it's on the rack, it's going to get sold. You can't manage to help the young customers as well. Then I'll find someone who can. I love this jacket. It would go perfect with that celebrity dress. Oh, let me go get it. Oh, no, 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 no. Girls, I have to take care of something. I'll be right back. Hi, I was Paige to call in. Alicia, I'm quite impressed with the results that I'm seeing since you started here. Oh, thank you, Mrs. Collins. You know, I feel like a lot of the staff is ignoring the young customer base. Yes, we've invested a lot in inventory that seems to do well with the aspirational young customer. You're right. A lot of our new customers are saying that they see our designs being worn by celebrities on social media. Isn't it great? It's like free advertising. Well, whatever you're doing, please bring in more designs like that. 
Well, I'll be sure to tell headquarters what you said. Why, thank you. And I really enjoy working here. Well, hopefully we get more salespeople just like you. Do you think this is stretchy enough? <laughs> it's bold. There you two are. Uh-oh, look who's back. Where are the dresses? Dresses? <laughs> They're here, over there, everywhere. This is the department store. I'm not talking about these. I'm talking about the Jenna Leaper dresses. Where did you hide those? Jenna Leaper? We don't have any of your dresses. Oh, really? Are you sure they're not in one of those bags? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. Why don't you look at my pack? Clearly they're not in here. Where did you put them? Uh, nowhere. Yeah, did you check that other lady? She seemed kind of sneaky. Mrs. Marcus? <laughs> She's one of our best customers. Best customer or not, why don't you look in her bag? Yeah, and stop bothering us. You know what? Let's all go to the security office and straighten this out. Fine, whatever. Alicia Summers. We have some missing dresses from the celebrity line. Really? Could it be your customers? No, it's not my customers. Well, can you see if they're carrying any large bags just in case? Fine, I'll check anyway. Okay, thanks. The celebrity dresses are missing. Is it Olivia's customers or Alicia's? Girls, how are we doing? Fine. <laughs> yeah, I love this. Me too, I'm definitely buying this. <laughs> I hate to bother you, but we've had an incident in the store. Incident? What's wrong? Well, we have some designer items missing and they're making us check in with all the customers. Oh my, what can we do to help? Nothing really. Wait, you two didn't bring any backpacks or large purses with you, did you? No. Why, are they on sale? Oh no, it has nothing to do with that. Go ahead and try the rest of your clothes on. You two, wait over there. I'm going to get security. Uh, what are you doing over here? Oh, I was just trying this on. <laughs> oh, really? You know what? I'm just gonna wait here for that sales lady. What is this about some stolen dresses? Yes, they're very expensive and one of these girls took them. Well, in that case, I'm gonna need to look in all of your bags. I already looked through them. They must have put them somewhere else. Well, regardless, I'm gonna need to check her bag just to be safe. You didn't check her. What? What do I have to do with this? She's right. She's a great customer. This is not about her. It's not me. It's her. She's obviously fake pregnant. Really? You think I'm hiding clothes in here? Now take a look at what's in this. Well, I guess we found our thief. <gasps> We have a special place to lock up people like you. 